unstuck. Does it get easier? No. Yes, it does. Yeah? <laughs> but look at you. <laughs> Thank you. It does. The more you know about yourself, you don't see things the same way. I just don't know what I'm supposed to be. Like, I always thought I wanted to be a writer. But I hate what I write. And I tried taking pictures, but John is so good at that. And mine are so mediocre. And every girl goes through photography phase. Like, horses. You know, taking pictures of your feet. <laughs> You'll figure it out. I don't worry about you. Keep writing. But I mean, <laughs> it's okay. What about marriage? Does that get easier? It's hard. We started going to a marriage counselor. Did that help? Did you learn anything? We established that we have no communication. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <sighs> we used to have so much fun together. She used to love going out with me to my movies. Mm. We would laugh at all those weirdos. <laughs> and then she got tired of all this stuff. She doesn't want to leave the kids. She didn't need me. And they didn't need me. I felt like I was in the way. It's complicated when you have children. It changes your life. That's too scary. When they're born, it's like Vietnam. It's terrifying. No one ever tells you that. <laughs> but... It is great when they grow up and can talk and can do things with you. That's nice. My parents were always traveling. They weren't around so much. Where'd you grow up? In DC. My dad was the ambassador to France in the 80s, so we went to school in Paris for a couple of years. But we mostly lived in DC. And they were never around. And then I moved to LA with John after I got married. Everything's so different there. I know. It 
John thinks I'm so snotty. You are. I know. But that's what you like about me. And why do you have to be with your opposite? Why can't similar people be together? Because that would be too easy. <laughs>